the first term of fundamentals is now over, and it was pretty awesome. Hey, what's a big Operation iDroid here, and in this video, I'm going to be doing a review of Assassination Classroom episode 16. If you haven't watched the episode yet, I highly recommend you do so by following the link in the description below and coming back to this video when you're done. With that being said, let's head into the review. Alright, so this episode takes off right where the last one left off and in the middle of the final exams of the first term. Now, I was a little confused in the last episode if this was like the finals finals, but this is not the finals finals. This was the finals for the first term. I think there's either two or three terms, not exactly sure, but it is not over yet. And as we saw at the end of the last episode, the first term of fundamentals is now over. So apparently they were only just learning the basics in this first term and in the following term, things are going to get a bit more advanced. And I'm really excited to see that because if this was just the fundamentals, what they were learning, it's going to be absurd what they're going to be learning with more advanced stuff. But anyways, as we saw this episode, they were taking the final exam. And as always, the animation of these final exams are just so amazing. And we can see how just like the little things that Koro Sensei was able to teach these students was the deciding factor in these tests. Like we saw it with Okuda when she was taking her science exam. Like when Koro Sensei told her that you can't just memorize science, you actually have to learn it. That's what helped her get a perfect score. And it's just like, Koro Sensei is such a good teacher because sure, a lot of this knowledge that they're learning they won't remember when they become adults and he even said it himself but the way that he teaches it to them and the way that he applies it to things is what makes them grow as people and that the competition within these tests is actually good for them because it teaches them the feeling of defeat and the feeling of competition which is going to help them within the rest of their lives so we got the results for the actual test, the final term, and as you all saw in the following episodes, they had two bets going on. They had the bets to take off Koro Sensei's tentacles, and they had the bets to take off, I mean, and the bets with the A class. And they won both bets. It was pretty insane to see that the students actually placed, I think it was three out of the five top scores in the five main subjects and then they placed top three in one of the other subjects which was home ec which was hilarious to see like our usual slackers in the class actually got the top scores in another subject which was home ec which was hilarious because Coral sensei didn't even see that coming himself and with that they were able to take away seven tentacles i believe that's how many tentacles they're going to be able to take off pro sensei whenever they decide to cash in their bets however it was pretty cool to see them actually win because it was kind of a blow to the heart when we saw them lose in the midterms and they tried really hard for that one but here in the final exams they were actually able to come through however there was one person that really didn't come through and i thought he was because they set it up pretty well. Like, they set up this fight during the test, which was Karma versus Asano for the math subject. And I was like, oh, this is going to be sick. I hope Karma wins because he's awesome. He's much better than Asano, which is the principal's son. But Karma did really bad, and it was disappointing. And it kind of makes sense why Karma did bad. Like, his talent and his potential can only take him so far. Because as we know, Karma does no studying whatsoever. And it was pretty evident because he didn't do as well as he thought he was going to do. And it was sad to see like Karma, like our guy, our man that always does so well, didn't do so well. And of course, as Koro Sensei said and completely came at the man's neck, like 
Koro Sensei held back nothing when he was reprimanding Karma. He, but at the end of the day, it's for a good reason because Karma will hopefully be able to bounce back from this defeat because as we know, he never likes to lose and maybe do better in the next exams. I don't know. We'll see. However, besides all that, I thought this was a very good episode and a great way to end the final term. We saw that the bet that the students placed with the A class came to flourishing and what they asked for was a summer intensive program, which was three days and two nights in Okinawa, which is kind of hilarious that they win and they choose to go to do more like schooling. But at the end of the day, that is pretty awesome, as well as that they were able to get good grades in their class and that even though the school still tries to bring down the E-Class after they placed all placed in the top 50 of this school, they really didn't care because as we saw at the assembly, they did their classic like E-Shot jokes and they didn't mind because they knew better. They knew they were wrong. Like they got top 50. Like look at the results. That's what you should be talking about. Not just that the E-Class is so bad, which it really isn't. It's pretty awesome. But all in all, I thought this was a great episode. Um, just success overall for the E-Class, and I'm so happy for them. This is just the beginning. Um, surprisingly, after being 16 episodes into this anime. So we have, it's confirmed for 24 episodes, so we have 8 more episodes. Pretty sure that someone told me that this is getting a second season, so that's pretty awesome. And I'm really enjoying Assassination Classroom. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below, as well as who is your MVP. Mine definitely has to be Koro Sensei because the students wouldn't be anywhere without them. Like, he is literally the greatest teacher ever. But anyways, thanks for watching, thanks for subscribing, and welcome to the operation.